Good morning. Welcome back. It is 622. And now it's time for KITV 4 Social Wire. And let's check in with our social media reporter, Yasmin Dar. Let's see what's buzzing on the web this morning. Yasmin? Hey, Dana Mejia. Well, a federal judge overturned California's ban of gay marriage, deeming it unconstitutional, and the comments started pouring in on ABC.com. PG Dion says this judge didn't strike down the gay marriage ban, he struck down democracy. It's a sad day, this is. This isn't about equal rights, it's about the sanctity of marriage and how gay marriages tarnish it. Tex Bork says, I support gay marriage and at the same time as a straight man wouldn't rescue myself of giving my ruling on matters of straight marriage, gay marriage or otherwise. Now in other news, Google may be the master of all things web. However, not all of their ideas have taken off. One of its most hyped products in 2009 was the Google Wave. A new in-browser communication and collaboration tool that was thought to be the next evolution of email. At one point, invitations to their product was going on for $70 on eBay. However, even after they dropped their invite-only status, users struggled to find the meaningful use of cases for the services, and its buzz quickly fizzled. Now, Google says it doesn't plan to continue developing Wave as a standalone product. If you want to join an on-hour conversation, of course, you can log on to our Facebook page. You can tweet us at KITV4 or log on to KITV.com. That's a look at what's buzzing on KITV4 Social Wire.